we did a number of things in terms of you know raising awareness and, and, and addressing some of the demand side uh, of, of factors that affect education. And so this included um, establishing network of adolescents in the community. We call them adolescent champions, and we did that very well across all the 60 schools. Uh, and so um, as we speak now, we set out to establish 200 and, uh, to, to basically reach 220 adolescent champions who form one network. And, and we've done that uh, very well. And these adolescents have gone out to, to be part of our very strong advocacy uh, campaign, uh, you know, network creating extremely impactful footprints on the, on the ground across the two states. One of the things that we've seen as we move towards the close of this project is that there's been a very significant shift in the way girls are being seen. A number of girls, quite a number of them have been able to return back to school. One directly because of the if, uh, effort and the work that our adolescent champions have done across all the 60 schools but also because of the awareness that our advocacy team has been able to make, you know, quite significant raise The efforts of some of our school-based management committees, uh, together with the community coalitions that we have at the community level. So there's been a huge shift in attitude. And so that has meant that now more girls who are traditionally would have been just at home are now back in school. The girl projects have filled up a vacuum in the area of one enrollment out of school children. Uh, they have went out for campaign to see that all children have been brought into the school, whether formal or non-formal learning centers. They ensure that all these gaps that have been missing, they try their best to see that uh, children are being enrolled into schools across the state. da farko dai zan yi godiya a wannan kungiya ta safe december da ta kawo mana wannan tallafi na mu taimaka yaran mu su yi makaranta kuma har na dauki iyata na bayar sai aka ga labarin cewa ashe abin mai kyau ne ya kamata yaran mu mu ma mu cusa makaranta sannan sauran talakawa suka yi sha'awa yanzu makaranta na yana cike dam primary na da yan mata da maza babban gaba wanda na samu a wannan tallafi yara wanda suke ciki sun samu uniform sun samu takardun karatu sun samu jakan kuna wanda za su rata ya kayan su da tsafta su tafi da shi mun samu ci gaban da yaran mu yanzu suna karatu za su iya rubuta sunan su sunan iyayen su zasu iya su yi magana da wani harshe daban ai mun mun gode game da rayuwar ta rabi ta tsaftace jikinta ta tsaftace mana gidan mu duk dan abin da muka samu daga tip December za mu iya mu mata uniform za mu iya mu sayi duk abubuwan da ya kamata wanda ya kyautu a gidan mu mu samu wani abu Actually, we have um, recorded a huge of success and achievements in SCI GAG project intervention. We have cash conditional transfer to parents. This one support them to allow their children to be in this school. It increased our school enrollment, more especially out of school and drop out. Uh, with this, I'm able to enroll 36 students. 30 out of them are girls. Uh, Save the children emphasize more on girls' child education. Ka 
kafin Hassana a makaranta ina talla kuma ina ce mama na da ayyuka a cikin gida ina ta ta kaman da wanke wanke shara ina ego wawa in ba ta da lafiya ina mana girki tunda aka sana a makaranta na samu canji da yawa na samu ilin na koyi yanda zan iya rubuta suna na a fifa mun samu takaddu da uniform da safa da jaka da sanda da nura da bairo da pencil da sharpener godiya da zan yi wa substitute da Canada shine Allah ya saka musu mun gode da jaka kuna da suka ba mu da uniform da kudi da aka ba wa iyayen mu da suka fitar da mu daga cikin talla suka samu a makaranta taimakon da muka samu na Canada na shatara sau hudu muka samu yawa kuma ya amfane mu da mu da yaran mu yaran mu da ba sa makaranta sai talli amma yanzu alhamdulillah suna makaranta kuma suna samun ilimi da dai gurguru kuma suna rubutu in sun je su gida sai su rubuta a jikin bango da abun da ba mu da shi yanzu muna samu kuma muna sai an an turo mana kudi har ga Allah muna sayan kayan abincin mu a je muna ce abun mu ba su da tagadda muna saya musu kuma a hakan ma alhamdulillah Canada tana ba su tagaddu muna godiya da kungiyan gab ya taimaka mana sosai game da yaran mu yana ba mu tallafi mu dubu 119 mun gode sosai kuma ya mana amfani kafin zuwan shi yaran mu yarinya na bata makaranta tana gida sun zo sun dauka min yarinya na sun sa mun ita a makaranta tallafin su ya mana amfani sosai ya taimaka mun da ni da yata an ba mu ina siya yata abinci kuma ina dan bata kudin zuwa makaranta break waye waye hakan nan kuma nima a cikin kudin ina dan sa juya ina dan kasuwanci na da shi ina sai da su dan gawayi haka a gida da dan wani abubuwan kayan miya haka da daya biyu hakan nan muna godiya da green coat da isom da tindire da gak sun taimaka mana sosai yaran mu ba sa makaranta sun tallafa mana yaran mu suna makaranta ina da yara mata da maza amma farkon zama na din ban sa yaran a makaranta ba suna zaune a gida ne suna taya ni ayyukan gida da kuma in ina wasu ayyuka na suma suna tallafa mun ta wani fanni sai wani kungiya ta zo sun fada kar da mu akan muhimmancin karatu ya mace to min mace idan ta yi karatu dan kar al'umman gari duka sun yi karatu sai na zo na saka yara na makaranta da mazan da mata yanzu presently suna zuwa makaranta still kuma na zo na kafa wani community a cikin anguwa na mata muna zama ko bayan sati biyu haka ko sati haka muna fada kar wa juna muhimmancin zuwa makaranta as an economic issue most families across northeast nigeria not necessarily economically strong and so being able to have children in school has been a factor that is directly affected by the poverty level of the house and then lastly i could also mention the fact that uh, there is the issue of of expectation is this project is one of those very exciting programs that aims to increase attendance of not just children but particularly girls so we, we, we when we went out through our interventions in cash one of the things that happened is that many parents would like to have their children join because they are seeing the gains particularly when you with the access the condition of cash and fund so those expectations around uh, you know this project are things that i would say were challenging because we can't meet the needs of every needful child uh, in this region